this Headsets Direct setup guide will feature the Savvy W710 wireless headset. Please note the Savvy W720 binaural version will be displayed in the following video, but the setup for the W710 is exactly the same. The Savvy 700 series comes with a headset, docking cradle, base unit, and cords. The first thing you'll want to become familiar with is the base unit. On the back, far left, you will find an AC power supply. Next position is where the optional handset lifter plugs into, your handset cable, and last, the USB connection that goes to your computer. Take the docking station and firmly press it down on the base unit on the right hand side. This is where you will store your headset and also is the charging portion of the base. The first step to plug into your phone is the cable that plugs into where the handset goes. Unplug your handset from the side of the phone and plug this cable into this side. The other end of the cable goes to the back of the base unit. There's only one place to plug this into. Next, plug your AC power cord in to the left side. That plugs into the outlet into your wall. And to the far right side is where the USB cable goes. This connects the base unit and the other end plugs into the USB port in your computer. The last cable to plug into is the handset cord goes back into that cable that came with the Savvy. That allows you to still use your telephone if the headset is off. Last, put your headset into the docking station and let it begin charging and it's ready for use. The Savvy 700 connects to three devices. To the top left of the base it shows you're connected to your computer. The middle button is your mobile phone and the right is your desk phone. At the bottom of the base the blue LED shows you're connected to your mobile phone and the green button below shows you're connected to your headset. To the side of the base unit is where you control your volume controls. To the left is your mic, to the right is your speaker, and the middle slide switch controls compatibility. As you look at the base unit to the bottom right, the light will come on when the headset is charging. Now to take a closer look at the Savvy W710 headset controls. To the left is your speaker volume down, to the right is your speaker volume up, both of those you can control during your call, and the headset on off LED light will flash green when you're on a call. The call control button is what turns the headset on and off. If you're using the optional handset lifter or electronic hook switch cable, by pushing the call control button that's what allows you to answer and hang up remotely. You also have a microphone mute and a noise canceling microphone extending forward from the earpiece. The Savvy 700 series allows you to connect a computer, mobile phone, and desk phone all to one headset. When you have an incoming call, pressing the call control button on your headset will automatically answer whichever device is ringing. To make an outbound call, pressing the call control button by default will go to your desk phone. If you need mobile or computer, you would press that button at the top of the base. You can also change what your default device is.